Yay, we're back, and also this terrible Whoa. Squirrel Girl box. No, oh my god, wow, it's that open that instant. So, she comes with a phone, which is pretty cool, or a tracker. Yeah, a unique accessory. Actually, I don't know if it's actually a phone. I think it it's say? like a control pad. It doesn't say anything. It, oh, I had it upside down. It's a tank. Whoops. Oh. Uh, Two, she has a wrench. Very interesting. A gun. And a shotgun. And yeah. the nice thing is, is it all fits in look. The wrench goes right... That's what I love about these. Whenever you can fit here. everything on it, it's awesome. The control pad goes right here. Gun here. And then obviously she has to hold the shotgun. But this is a really good looking figure. I'm, this one is definitely probably the best out of the bunch here. Mm -hmm. I mean, look. look at how accurate she looks to the original figure too. Articulation is not bad. I mean, it's... A little hinder, like, with the coat, but not too much. I know. I've always loved the coat with the fur. That's been one of my favorite things. But, seriously, definitely a good figure. Mm-hmm. The only problem I can see with this specific one is the gun is already warped. I mean, the shotgun. Uh, yeah, I see it. But other than that, she is a really good uh, figure. Like I said, a really good face, too. Since right now, for females, all we have are Baroness, Lady J, Zorana, and Scarlet. Scarlet. So adding another one is really cool. Me, yep. cover girl. Mm -hmm. So definitely de one of the better ones in the bunch. I'm trying to think who else. Well, they need to make Jinx. Yes, yeah, so I'm kind of shocked we haven't other gotten Jinx. Other than that, who are some of the main females in G.I. Joe? I don't actually know who I'm forgetting. I feel like there's like one other big one I'm forgetting. I mean, there's like Zartan's daughter, but she's not like big. I'll back. Oh, jeez. What? No, so I mean, he's in his original no, toy outfit. Yeah, that part's cool, but someone was right on what they said. On what they said, they say he got sunburned. Yeah. Oh, butterfly joints. That's nice. Well, I definitely, obviously, I'm gonna probably like this one more than the Tiger Force yeah. one, even though I'm pretty sure he comes with. Does he come with the same accessories? Probably. It'd be kind of shocking if he didn't. Oh, he has the same accessories. So he got the little... Like, Flashlight. Yeah. The shovel. The knife. Yep. His gun. The backpack. The gun. And the... What is this? The clip? Yes. I think it's for this gun. Yeah, it is. Yeah. So, butterfly joint. So obviously articulation is the same. Cause I'm pretty sure all he is is just a repaint. Mm-hmm. So. Survival. Yeah, but articulation's pretty good. I believe he shares Duke's legs, but I'm not 100% sure on that. Uh, let's try and set him up. He can fit everything on him. Yeah, I, I remember, remember because... That. I was impressed. Mm -hmm. And happy. But yeah, he does look a little, like, burnt. I mean, honestly. This orange, they it's did a little too much. because he's been out in the jungle too much. It gets hot out there. True, but... I don't know. Hi in the jungle, baby! Gonna die. All right, let's get them all set up. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's probably better if he just holds it, or at least like <coughs> that. Yeah. But I really like the butterfly joint that they did. They are very nice. I mean, he does look pretty good. Just a little too orangey in some spots. But survival. Definitely prefer him over the Tiger Force one. Me too. Then this one, which I'm afraid to see this frog's face. I am happy that they made him. I am just very shocked that they made him before some other people. Yeah. Because, like, what about Hulk? <laughs> I mean, we are getting him, but it's like... What about some of the first 12? What about Flash? Flash is a need. I want Flash. Ugh. Let me see. It is as bad as they say. Ugh. Yeah. He, he looks is. like someone. I just can't think of him. You? No, I mean, I guess. But I don't know. Someone else. Toad. 
pickle fucker. <laughs> All right, so he's got this parade to help hide his horrible face. It doesn't. In fact, it might be worse. Uh, he's got a shotgun with the. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Horrible. All right. He's got a knife. Pretty cool looking knife. And then, and then that's a unique backpack. Yeah, so this is definitely antenna. the first time we've gotten this one. So let's get them all ready. Some oh, is this where his knife goes? Oh yeah, so his Ooh, knife that's goes. Pretty cool. He has his little ass guy. <laughs> He's got a green watch. Oh, it even has the uh, hands or arms mm. to tell time. That's pretty cool. And then definitely a very unique shotgun. So. I mean, this is a really good figure, in my opinion, except for the His horrendous face. head. Because that is, that is really bad. Yeah. I mean, Hasbro, you, you could have done better. You really could have. All right, so... Out of Here's these. our new figures, and we're missing the Crimson Bat, like we said, which is another repaint. Yeah, so you had three repaints. And then two new figures, and one looks like a frog, kind of. Yeah, so she's definitely the best figure. That Actually, that's who I was thinking. He kind of looks like James from Twin Peaks. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anyway, uh, for me, rating-wise, I think I... I mean, look at how... Look at the camera, how, how burnt he looks on here. It looks worse yeah. on the camera. Yeah, that doesn't purse. Um, but for me, I think I'd give him an 8, because other than his, like, burnt skin, he looks pretty good. I think I'd honestly give him a 7. Not really that wowed by him. I'd give him an 8 as well, just because the face is the only thing that doesn't do it to me. And I'd give CoverGirl a 9. So I would give Outback a 7, a little too orangey. Her an 8, because she's really good. Him a 7 just because, eh, I mean, it's a good mold, but I didn't need the Marauder barbecue, honestly. I didn't. Yeah. Him, I can only give him a 7. Great body, but horrendous head. Yeah. And the shotgun does look a little cheap, like in the front. It's got, like, no paint to it. So, I mean, yeah, it has to be part of that, but everything else looks kind of meh. Meh. So, that's the newest wave minus the Crimson Bat, which, to be honest, he's just a repaint, so he probably wouldn't have ranked that high anyway. No. So, anyway, bye.